What? This boy better get it bad. <laughs> oh, you bastard. Welcome back, gay schools, and everyone in between to our YouTube channel, The, the Horror, Horror Bandwagon. Hi, I'm Mr. Sergio. And my name is Cody. And we are boys for horror analysis. Criticism. And spooky, okay? And sometimes kooky. Entertainment. And welcome back to another movie night reaction. Today, we are finally going to be watching 2022's The Menu. Mm -hmm. This is a highly anticipated movie for me. I feel like I say that in every video, but it truly <laughs> is. I, 2022 was full of movies that I've been dying to watch, yeah. but we've been holding off because we wanted to react to this and watch it together with you guys. Now, this movie has some heavy hitters. We have Anya Taylor-Joy. We have Ray Fiennes. Which we just found out is pronounced Rafe Fines. Fines, yes. And I made Cody say it because I forgot. <laughs> but we also know really nothing about this movie except that it's about a bunch of people who get invited to go to this restaurant and food stuff happens, mm -hmm. which we like. We watch the Food Network. Yes. Well, especially Cody. I do. Cody watches the Great British Baking Show. Mm -hmm. What else? <laughs> Worst Cooks Alive. <laughs> like, <laughs> Worst Cooks in America, Chopped, lots of them. I, I love cooking shows. So obviously this is going to be exactly like that. I think so, where nothing happens and it's completely normal. Mm -hmm. But before we find out exactly what is on the menu today, <gasps> make sure that you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click that notification bell so you get notified every time we post a new video. Now, let me just say transition queen here. Transition queen. But without further ado, let's get cooking. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I'm gonna keep my wine over here, away from those hands. I love this, because it makes me feel like we're, we're at a show. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Invites you to experience. The menu. I just need like opera glasses. Well, I did bring wine to dinner. Oh, I have coffee infused with tequila. Mm -hmm. Classy. Babe, please don't smoke. It'll kill your palate. Then my palate will die happy. Hey. Is that foreshadowing? I know. Something about smoking, killing palates. When you smoke, you ruin your ability to be able to appreciate <laughs> Come on. them. Please. Please. This is us, though. You are like, no, you could ruin your palate. Let's I'm like, be clear. Neither one of us smoke. So this true. is not exactly us. Also, neither one of us is rich enough to go to some like fancy island <laughs> to have some like, catered things. One so. day. One day. Fucking crazy. I just go with the flow. Let it be magical. Hey, it's your dime. Also, this is paid for, right? Well, yeah, by him. All right. Take me anywhere, Nicholas Holt. Great. Power tasting. They'll be wasted by the amuse. Hi, guys. See, I have a feeling like I'm going to relate so hard to Anya Taylor Joy's character. Okay, well, it's official. Tonight will be madness. <laughs> All aboard for Honestly, it would be fun to, like, just, you know. I knew you would love treat this. Treat yourself. I knew it. And like, there's all these celebrities there, and you get to just like, you know, rub elbows with with the upper class for but a little bit. But you would know all like the famous chefs and everything, and I would be like, who's that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not that far away. Yeah. Felicity <laughs> Lynn and, and Damian Mr. Garcia. Diaz. Mr. Diaz. Give my real name. Of course, I gave him your real what name. What about Thank if you get you. paparazzi? Oh my god. Margo, welcome. We'll endeavor to make your evening as pleasant as possible. I think he originally made these plans with somebody else. I can't wait to see how this turns out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. That was really awkward. I'm sorry. That was not. No, no. Fine. Don't worry about us. Wait, how long have you been been together? I don't know. 
But like my my mind is already churning. I'm like, all right. So does that mean like that they were that they're now not happy because they were expecting somebody else? I mean, obviously, so far we're seeing that that her character is not like the rest. Yeah. You know. Oh, oh shoot! Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Those trees look a lot bigger than I thought they were. Right. Buy them better. Yeah. 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 We have yeah. reached the base camp of not bullshit. This is insane. <laughs> <laughs> but please do not touch our proteins, they're immature. So what happens if you serve it on the 153rd day? Does all hell break loose? Or... Introduce itself to the consumer's bloodstream and spread into their spinal membranes, after which point he or she would become incapacitated and shortly thereafter expire. You tell him. <laughs> you tell him. Each day starts at six with five hours of prep work. We harvest, we ferment, we slaughter, we marinate. And we slay. Hey. That's <laughs> that we all live here. You guys ever get burnt out or? Burned out? Yeah, sorry, sorry. Like tired of. I don't know the meaning of the word burned out. Peasant. Oh, look at that. Take a picture. Ooh. Welcome some food porn. <laughs> Although they really should be wearing gloves if they're handling liquid nitrogen like oh, that. Oh, no. You can't start this. <laughs> I'm not, I did not sign up for you to call these things out. It smells. You will be sitting in this Westervelt seat. Just, you should have a better view. Not the shady reminder. You'll be seated in the, in the seat that was supposed to be for somebody else. But please do not photograph our dishes. Chef strongly... <laughs> You put that thing away, girl. Femoral nature. Here, come on, we can't miss this. Oh. Mm. Honestly, I would love to just watch them work, though. No jet? Exactly right, sir. Mm. You know, a Paco jet can produce. Yeah, yeah, yes, I know that. I know that fact. Texture. Cool. Yeah, I have one. This is us. This is us at a restaurant or like, you. I'm literally like, awesome. I, <laughs> I can't. I can't right now because I do not talk to the people who make our food. No, but like you this. would give me a little like little fact, well, which I appreciate and I love. Yes, but you're making it sound like I just go into the restaurant. And I go into the kitchen. I'm like, so are you making this this way? As I because said, he's just an extra version of you, and you're already extra as is. <laughs> oh no. What a warm welcome. Amuse Bouche, mm -hmm. which is also gonna be my upcoming drag name. I wanna hear your pitch for the show, but first I would like to say thank you for the last two years. This opportunity has been. Uh... <gasps> you oh. bastard! No, you're it, you're done. No, it ain't, no, it ain't. Yes, it is. I'm starting to. Oh my god! <laughs> I told you this two weeks ago. Yo, they hate her. <laughs> they hate her. And money. Work. The work and money. Yeah, baby. Mm -hmm. Yeah, baby. We're pathetic, aren't we? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Somebody shoot us. <laughs> no coño, yes. The amount of times that that was said in my household growing up. <laughs> During its last dying contraction of muscle, it's art on the edge of the abyss, which is where God works, too. It's the same. That was beautifully put, Tyler. Yeah, that was great. How many girls has he said this to, huh? <laughs> Get it. Really? Yeah, a little. Meaning not at all. Yeah. <laughs> so it's coming off as if he's he doesn't study this. It's just like he's a fan of it. Yeah, he's like the foodie of all foodies. Over the next few hours, you will ingest fat, salt, sugar. Sugar. Spice. And everything nice. The ingredients of the uh, Powerpuff Girls. <laughs> what? Uh, no. Food. Yeah, yeah, bring it, bring it. All right. I sure got a napkin. I'm ready. <laughs> on rocks from the shore, covered in barely frozen filtered seawater, which will flavor the dish as it melts. OK, I'm not going to lie. That sounded hot. Is meaningless compared to what happens outside in nature in the soil and the water i think he's having an orgasm he legit <laughs> in in the middle of this nature is timeless enjoy every time he speaks just like in harry potter i literally am enthralled mm -hmm. 
Oh, no. Are you crying? <laughs> it's just like, you're embarrassing me. I'm pretty sure he doesn't even know about your existence. I kind of want him to. Like you? <laughs> yeah, kind of. Oh, he's, he's like actively crying. He's mm -hmm. still crying. It doesn't really matter whether he likes you or not. Right. Wait, what is that? Mm -hmm. Relax, just eat your rock. Oh, girl, I think you're too good for him. Oh my God, Vakarla is not brain surgery, I know. okay? Okay, it's, so it's then a goddamn travel food show. Yeah, yeah. So, so pitch it to me. Okay, so. Ooh, that's a good way to put it. Mm -hmm. Pitch it to me. Tell me what's it about. I'm with cheese, I eat the cheese, and then I, there's a close up on me, and I close my eyes and I fake an orgasm, and then. <laughs> <laughs> not so cool, and bingo bongo. Emmy time. So okay, it, can I eat now? That's what you're gonna pitch with three streaming services on yeah, Monday. Pretty much. Yeah, I mean, Jesus, I also feel like they're also poking fun at the idea of like a lot of celebrities having their own cooking shows on the network or like yeah. they travel the world and try different things. I'm pretty sure Stanley Tucci has one. Oh, he does. He has that thing where he like goes around Italy. But I love Stanley Tucci. Yeah. And how did Jesus teach us to pray if not to beg for our daily bread? It is and has always been the hero worship. Tonight, you get no bread. No bread? Breadless bread plate? No bread savory company? Oh no, girl. I love my bread. Me too. <laughs> when they come around and here's your bread, oh, I'm a happy boy. I can serve bread at a restaurant known for their bread. That's sweet. What? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What? what? But I love, and it hurts me a little bit, where it's like, but you are not the poor. <laughs> you get no bread. I feel like, oh, geez. I, I mean, he's he's always been keenly aware of food as a history of class. I mean, yeah. as have I. Sure. I as like, have I. He's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is, this is fine. Like be split. I mean, I wasn't going to say anything. I noticed as soon as it came down. It's yeah. broken. Oh, shut up. You know you don't know. What the overarching theme of the entire meal is going to be. You won't know till the end. Wait, you you like this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what's? I feel like this is really setting us up for like her to catch on really early what's happening and him to just be in denial up until the point where he's literally like dead. Oh, no. Well, no one said anyone's going to die in That's this movie. That's true. I'm just I'm jumping to conclusions. <laughs> Here is another broken emotion. Oh. <gasps> Oh my god, gags. Stop it. Right now. That is fierce. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, you caught that? Here's a little bit more of it. But could we please get a little bread, you know, and some gluten free for my friend as well? No. 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 I mean, you paid for a set menu. You know who we are, right? Yes. You do? I know who you are. Mm -hmm. You know, we work with Doug Varick. Right? You know what? I'm very forgetful. Okay. Apparently. <laughs> no, you work for Mr. Varick. <gasps> exactly. Oh, and okay. so, you know, we all play on the same team. So just. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, Did you say no? I said no. Yes. Okay. She said it like three, four times. Mm -hmm. You will eat less than you desire and more than you deserve. It's a pleasure to serve you. That's all you got to do. I love her. Uh -huh. She's so creepy, but she is so Fierce. good. Like she doesn't care. Like she doesn't care about what these people think. Ugh. Well, thank you for your concern, but I am perfectly capable of deciding when I eat and what. Oh, yes. What everyone's thank thinking. <gasps> and the thank you at the end. Love it. All right, that looks like bread. Okay, this is good. There's a 2013. It's like a Cornish hen. <laughs> That's all I know. It's <laughs> not a Cornish hen. I don't know. <laughs> She's staring again. Where do we know her? We don't. It does look like Claire. Why do you keep saying that? She doesn't. <gasps> again, another piece of the puzzle to, to like. Pick apart. He proceeded to wrap a telephone cord around her neck and pull it tight. I wept, I screamed, and begged him to stop. Oh my lord. I finally had to stab him in the thigh with kitchen scissors. 
Oh. I suppose I should have stabbed him in the throat that evening. But we're not so smart when we're young. <laughs> I'm like, this is odd. Oh, thank God again. I mean, what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, that's like a, you like that? Yeah, it's a backstory to what makes him a, a chef artist. I don't mind this as much because someone said theatrical, and I'm like, I live for the theater. I did mm -hmm. like this is extra. Smoked breast chicken thigh, al pastor, wrap wrap and our own up. tortillas uh -huh. made with heirloom mast. One of Hawthorne's signature dishes. See, if I knew I was going into a horror restaurant. I would love this, but this is a personal. We hope this taco night evokes strong memories for us all. Enjoy. I can't wait to see. I saw that something was on the tortillas. What is it? Let me see. What are they? Well, they're restaurants. Um, oh, that's cute. That I reviewed that all closed. Oh. Like a gag, then. Um, I think so. The amount of shadiness in this movie is too much. Things for the tacos. No, the, the pictures, happy anniversary. They're, they're all of us. <gasps> so what are going to be on the tacos at the table where Anya Taylor-Joy was not supposed to be? I cannot wait to see. Your fucking photos. Oh, <gasps> they just I just took it now. Uh-huh. It's not good. Uh, excuse me. Filthy. I love it. I help you, sir. <clears throat> yeah, what, what the hell are these? These are tortillas. <laughs> <laughs> are these? These I are can't. tortillas. <laughs> it's tax records and other documents showing how your company has created invoices with fake charges. <gasps> how did you get these? Get them. Get them. Get their asses. Well, how the hell should I know? It's oh. It's some sort of, sort of stupid joke. Oh, and that is so good, the detail. Uh-huh. Daddy has been fooling around. I'll tell you how you make it right. You send the shit back. Excuse me. Excuse me, hey, sir. Marco. Hi. Marco. Oh, I love her so much. Did you just fucking snap? <gasps> no, and I don't really you care. You do not send shit back to this kitchen, you child. You thank them for eating money. You, you child? child? Girl, walk out. Get an Uber boat. She looks so good. She mm -hmm. looks so good. You shouldn't be here tonight. Please get the fuck out of my way. You better do what she says, Voldemort. It's called The Mess. Originally from Sparks, uh, Nevada, Jeremy studied at the Culinary Institute in Hyde Park. I don't like where this is going. Uh, is he just gonna like slit his throat? <gasps> but he's not great. He'll never be great. Oh, you said this to me last night. No, I did not. It sounded familiar. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your fourth course. Oh no. Is the mess. Uh-uh. No, don't, uh, don't clap. Oh! You knew it was coming. What's wrong with you? What the fuck is that? I was a shock. I didn't see that coming. Uh, what? He's lost it. He's lost it. Is he dead? It's definitely it's... like a squib or like right. a, a pack. I you to sit down. I've seen them use it. Before. It's not funny. Take it. Oh, and there's like inklings of people not really knowing what's going on. They're thinking it's fake. That looks like a bone. That looks like a bone. Yeah. It's bone bear. <gasps> Real Jeremy Lo Oh. Jeez. Not Rip Jeremy uh -huh. in the menu. Uh huh. Uh uh. These guys need to start getting a clue. Like, this isn't normal. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll handle this. Just. just with which handle. hand, Mr. Liebrand? What? With which hand will you handle this, left or right? What the fuck are you saying? Don't like the options. Come me out. Come me out. No. Oh, come on. Come on. Leave the guy alone. Can everybody really start panicking now? Mr. Liebrand, please hold still. Oh! They did it! 
Is she crying or laughing? I, I don't know. I don't know either. I'm so confused because I don't know yeah. what the mood of the of the atmosphere is right now. This is real, isn't it? Can't do it. Can't, can't do it. Can't do it. Go talk to him because you know him, right? I made that up. <gasps> you liar! Lies on Lies. No, no, I'm sorry, but you're all wrong. Why are you doing this? You're just simply wrong. What are you talking about? Who are you? Girl, I'm gonna have to drink some more. What to is make in the sense What is in the freezer behind them? Can't you see that? And that'd ruin the menu. We're all gonna die tonight. <gasps> Is, do you want to die with those who give or with those who take? But I die either way. It's arbitrary. Okay, well, we solved it there. <laughs> They're all dying. In the meantime, please return to your seat. The next dish is exquisite. Are you going to share that info to the other people? Yes, Chef! I love you all. We, we love you too, Chef! All right, girl, this must be some sort of cult or something. Yeah, I don't know. something is not right here. I just like, I can't figure out like why. <gasps> Protein or veg? Justified. I hate him too. Why do you get a kitchen, of course? <gasps> Smoke all day, can't even fucking taste it. I, I want him to get it. Yeah. I do. I want him to get it. Cowards. This worked in a movie they call The Assault. When they bring the knives and force, we just start the kitchen, okay? You think we have better knife skills than them? What other choice? That's also true. Yeah. That's also true. They handle knives. Ah! I'm gonna break this fucking window. Oh, my God. Ah! oh you knew that was gonna I mean. happen. Come on. Is this bergamot I'm getting, Chef? Yes, it is. <laughs> he hates you, bro. That is to be expected. And no, you fed my ego as well. Ten minutes, Miss Mills. Please, my. Oh, she needs to decide mm -hmm. in ten minutes. Oh shit. Lebron, kindly name one dish you ate the last time you were here. Oh no, not one. <laughs> you can't think of one. Even say something. Time you were here. Or the time before. One, please. See, I told Risotto. you this is all it's punishment for everybody. Yeah. Cod. See, cod. exactly. Go for it one was thing. A cod, you donkey. <laughs> now things are a little more complicated, and I own Doug Verrick. Stop it. Just, just fucking tell us how to stop this. We'll stop it, okay? You can't stop Obviously, it. Obviously, we have money. Just say how much and we'll give it to you. How is he held up there? I don't need your money. Well, what do you want, <laughs> man? <gasps> oh, you idiot. That looked like it hurt. This is fucking insane. I said listen. No. Is there gonna be like a giant shark or something? Oh my god, if there's a fucking shark, I'm gonna lose it. You hear? Or maybe he's just gonna drown. Uh, that's also possible. Which is also very disturbing. Yeah. Under he goes, sad, quiet. Do you hear it? I hate this. I hate this. Mm -hmm. I hate watching or knowing people are drowning. I don't like that. You're not sure I'm brilliant, so don't say it. It's false. Fine. I'm not sure that you're brilliant. Oh, I was expecting more. Oh my God. Toxic behavior. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you thought I couldn't tell? Oh, I know a fellow service industry worker when I see one. Mr. Liebrand. How do you know him? You know what they're saying, right? No. What kind of service industry do you think that she's in? Oh. He told me to agree with everything he said and continue eye contact while he jerked off. Mm -hmm. well, specific. Not really. Pretty unoriginal. Things are getting juicy. I'm mm -hmm. like, okay, tell me more. Ladies and gentlemen, for our next course, let us take the evening air. Come on, outside. Oh, they're going outside. Mm -hmm. Field trip, everybody. <laughs> I don't know where this movie is going at all. It's okay. No, we're gonna die today. Yes. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's like no, no. We're, yeah, it's bad. Julian Slowick tried to fuck me. I refused his advances. A week later, he tried again. 
but he didn't fire me. Our next course is called Man's Folly. It just made me like 10 times more uncomfortable. <laughs> oh. <gasps> I'm sorry. Mm. Oh, that is pointy. Head start. At which point, members of my staff will try and catch you. If they do catch... Okay. <laughs> Five seconds starts now. Bit Run! This is like the Hunger Games! Sixth course. What is the sixth? Man's Folly. Dungeness crab fermented yogurt whey dry... I don't... I couldn't read fast enough. It's delicious. There was a time that would have meant a lot to me, Miss Bloom. She worked at one of the restaurants that, that she closed down. Mm -hmm. I think, I think. It's, it's mm. so good. Yeah, it's really okay. good. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's the emoji for me. In the book. <laughs> <laughs> it's the emoji for me. You know my husband. <laughs> oh, this poor man. Oh no, this poor man. I mean, rule number one, if you're being chased by people who want to kill you, um, don't make noise. Yeah. You should have your own place, right? Mm -hmm. I could help you with that. I'm sure you could, Miss Bloom. I could, I could. We, we would just... Okay, let's bargain. Let's negotiate. <laughs> the, the dying thing. Oh, everyone dying was my pitch, actually. <laughs> Super proud of it. <laughs> Wrong girl then. Wrong girl. Sorry. Oh, you found a boat. Yep. Gah. So what happens if they catch you? I forgot. Well, I thought that they were going to kill them, but maybe it looks like they're escorting them back. Sir, please. Excuse me. Sorry. I'll take that. Everything's fine. It's blue. This guy oh I, is too much for me. I can't. You told me... It be the greatest menu ever created. Right, and? And? That everyone would die. Everyone would die. He knew all along! That's just because you don't offer scenes for one. So you hired her knowing she'd die. Oh, this this boy better get it bad. I don't need that. Yes! Yes! yes. You Sad piece of shit. Mm -hmm. I could taste it. <laughs> yeah, you could, yeah, I know, but you identified it. Mm -hmm. Picked it out. Right. <laughs> that impressed me. Yeah, I... I'm nervous. Me too. <laughs> Courtesy of Hawthorne. Mm -hmm. No one is happy for you, dude. You're a cook. Oh, I don't know so if I can cook. cook. Here. Cook. Now? Cook. I don't. Cook. Go on now. Oh God, this is like humiliation. This is like somebody calling you out on, on something you wrote on your resume. Everyone gather around. You must learn from Tyler. This is a, a, new, uh, a new dicing method of which we have been. Oh, this is so nerve wracking. I don't know why this is like awful. Butter, leeks and shallots sauteed in butter. I bear witness to a revolution in cuisine. Do you like uh, protein? Oh, this is so embarrassing. Yeah. This is my anxiety is going away. Oh. This is literally if anyone told me like, yeah, I can be on that show. And then they said, okay, go. And this is why I never say I could be on that show. And that's just like the worst thing that can happen to him is that he is a bad chef. It's actually quite bad. <laughs> oh my God. Tyler's bullshit! No! <laughs> Undercooked lamb. lamb. Utter lack, lack of, of cohesion. cohesion. <laughs> Jesus. Yes. Read this bitch. Fuck off, Tyler. Oh, share with the class, please. What do you think he told them? I don't know. I mean, the wall of all the ingredients is really cool, though. 
No, no, I do not. Neither do I. That is because my negligent colleague, Elsa, forgot to assign someone to bring it. Oh, no, not her. I like her. Elsa, give her the smokehouse key. Yes, chef. The smokehouse is the one with the, like, the meat and stuff in it, yep. right? Okay. <gasps> oh, that's dark. Yeah. That's a little too dark. <laughs> it's a bit dark. I mean, he, so he literally just told him, like, you're worth nothing. Go kill you yourself. You should kill yourself. Yeah. Oh, no. So far, that's the only person who has, from the original group, who has, who has died. died. Yes. I don't think it's really fair. Maybe. If 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 if. Do you want to know why you're being punished? Okay. Yeah. Do it. Tell us. I saw the film calling Doctor Sunshine. I did not enjoy it. Sorry. It was a Sunday. My one day. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. The memory of your face in that film, seeing you again now, haunts me. <laughs> oh my God. What school did you go to? Brown. Student loans? No. I'm sorry, you're dying. <gasps> oh my God. Meanwhile, the this rest of us millennials. I know. <laughs> We're safe. Hey. <laughs> in debt. <laughs> <laughs> Fancy. There's the silver door. Yeah. Is that to the other side? Is that what is on Maybe. the other side? Okay. Why would you die for him? He will not replace me. Replace you? Uh, trust me, I have no. <laughs> oh! <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh, girl, you're gonna have to get some sort of weapon. Mm -hmm. Let's pick this up. Oh, I don't even know what she grabbed. Oh, shit. He didn't tell me about the barrel. I didn't forget. Oh, no. Yep, you just killed somebody. Uh-huh. Oh, damn. I liked her. She was one of my favorite characters. I mean, she... I mean, she, she was part it. of the problem. Yeah, she was. But she was. I liked her. I liked her sass. Oh, that was written by the girl who's there, Lillian, Lillian Bloom. Bloom. Hmm. Oh, that was the guy who he drowned. Yeah. Picture of him actually looking happy cooking. Yeah. It's a radio. See, this would be so bad for me. I don't know how to use it. Birthday, <laughs> what? What is Christ. happening here? Happy the sharpness of this, I do not trust. You. you told him it was my birthday? Seemed funny about three hours ago. <laughs> <laughs> I can carry a cast iron from a hot oven to your table with no protection. What? Can you do that? No. <laughs> I mean, I can, but I will be horribly burned. Yeah. Voluntarily given by the oppressor. It must be demanded by the oppressed. Did he just quote Martin Luther King? Yep. Yes, he did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. But she managed to call help. Yes. Yes, bitch. Did you call someone? I don't know. This is a setup. Yeah. This is some sort of fucking setup. There is something going on. Not help you. Ask yourselves two things. One, if you really want to be responsible for the death of an innocent man. And two, ask yourselves. Oh, they will kill him if uh. they ask. <gasps> that is fucking maniacal. Did anybody here call in a distress over the shortwave tonight? This man is fucking bloody in his face. Everyone's sweaty and crying. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Would you like his autograph? Well, uh, 
I don't want to bother you. Oh, no. no, no he doesn't. No, they, they, why not, like, just be like, oh, I actually, I have a last minute emergency. Can I come with you? You don't have to say anything is up. Yeah. Oh, he can write. Uh, what, what's your name? Dale. And that's what he's going to do. And he's going to kill him. Uh -huh. No. Bothering you folks. I'll, I'll be leaving now. For all you do, man. Time. Well, thank you for your service. Well, at least he got something out of it. Uh -huh. Please be smart about it. Just Please leave be smart about it. and get oh, oh, everyone now. No, no, no. You're, you're joking. Easy. You're joking. What are you doing? What are you doing? Everyone, do not speak. On your knees with your hands over your head now. No, 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 no. Because it would have been just as easy to take out the guy when he showed up and have put one of your chefs in the thing or pay off the guy ahead of time. This was so mean. Yep. You're an eater. You're a taker. Like all the rest. All right. Let, let's start trying to find ways to kill this guy because we, we need to get out of the, the island. Final course. And then she starts saying, on my own. <laughs> I don't like your food. What did you say? I said, I don't like your food, and I would like to send it back. No compliments to the chef today. We always cook with love, don't we? No, chef! Everyone knows love is the most important ingredient. And then you're kidding yourself. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> this is one of them you cook with obsession, not love. She's calling you out. Even your hot dishes are cold. You need to get her on like one of the, the comp food competitions <laughs> and repeat this exact monologue. What are you hungry for? What do you have? Everything. A burger. Like, she's gonna say me. a burger. A cheeseburger. Mm. Yeah. A real cheeseburger. Not some fancy deconstructed avant bullshit. A real cheeseburger. Juicy. Bur burger. I would like to buy a hamburger. I would like to buy a hamburger. Crinkle cut for Julienne. Mmm. All right. So I, I, I want I want a meaty burger. This is heavenly angel music. Oh, I can smell. I can smell that burger. This movie should have come with like scratch and sniffs at the theater. Like you could just oh scratch God. and sniff like the, the aroma. Mm. <laughs> I'm like, what's the verdict, girl? No, that is a cheeseburger. Yeah, that is a cheeseburger. Just make out. Can I get the rest to go? Oh. Ooh. Is this gonna work? One cheeseburger to go. And even wrapped it up himself? Everything. Is this gonna work? What happened to mom? She's drunk. Oh. oh, she's like, do it. Just go. How did this work on what? What? And everybody dies. Let's go. <laughs> so once again, thank you for dining with us. Is everyone really gonna die? Oh, is that a marshmallow like wrap? It is. It is. Are they going to light them all on fire? That's what I'm thinking. I think they're going to light them on fire. Oh my fucking God. And now, our Girl, I don't want to be the snack. I know I'm a snack, but I don't want to be 
it. The s'more. The most offensive assault on the human palate ever confronted. <laughs> On an unrelated note, did you know, and you can look it up, the Grand Cracker was invented to stop people from masturbating. <laughs> that is something for another day. <laughs> he subsumed and made a new. Thank you. Did she say thank you? Yeah, I think so. I think they're like willing to do it. Oh my god! Not in the eyes! Oh. Mm hmm. S'more. Marshmallow chocolate. Customer staff <laughs> restaurant. Oh my god! Oh my god. Hey, at least you got a cheeseburger from it. I can't believe that worked to get her out of there. I cannot believe that worked. Girl. Oh my god. god! What the fuck? Oh my god! That movie w was a roller coaster ride. Yes, I will was. say, it. I think what this movie did really great was that I really had no clue what was going on. Oh yeah, I mean, so we had we had avoided all spoilers. The yeah. most I had heard is that this movie doesn't take itself seriously. And so yeah. I wasn't really sure if we were coming into like a full on horror comedy or what was yeah. going on. I loved this. I think it was, this was great. Yeah. That there wasn't really like some big underlying thing to figure out. Oh no, like, not at all. Because then they kind of like gave it to you. It was like, oh yeah, you're all gonna die. And who knows who who is gonna die along the way. Um, I mean, what I loved most about it is because like it's, it's satirical. It's a yeah. satire on, you know, booty life. And it's a caricature, like we said earlier. Mm -hmm. And I actually really like the thing that I, that I think I like the most about it is that when you sit back and you think like about what was going on in the movie, mm -hmm. just like how in a really fine dining restaurant, everything is on the plate for a specific reason. Yeah. Everyone who was invited tonight was there for a specific reason. They were all ingredients in the overall meal because you had the couple who just kept coming back because the food was expensive, so it must be good, but they weren't actually getting any joy out of it. Yeah. You had the person who made his career and destroyed so many others. Exactly. You have the three people who were profiting off of the illegal schemes yeah. that his benefactor was doing. You had the guy who was only there because he didn't like his movie and mm -hmm. it like that broke him so because funny. it was his one day off. <laughs> and you had the guy who was so obsessed to the point of literal hero worship. And as people were dying, all he wanted was more of his food. Yeah. He thought that he could do it. And in the end, he just showed him that he couldn't, that he was not, it was not of the same cloth that the chefs were, even though he thought he was. And, yeah. and like, it just, it all came together so well. I really, truly love this movie. I actually think it was really, really enjoyable. I, there were points where I thought it, something was gonna happen and it just didn't, but then it went to a totally different place. I think all the characters were unlikable to a point that I kind of loved them mm -hmm. because they were so funny and so specific but it, it also my emotions are just everywhere because I'm I'm sad parts of it were beautiful parts of it were funny some of it was disturbing like kind of kind of went down a dark path where I was like oh this is not haha -ha. yeah um, but like I also love the idea of you know the menu like there's like it's always just like an experience and these people went for an experience and what better way to experience but death and then we get them being actual s'mores at the end like what the fuck and then like, they all just seem to, to just accept to just it accept they're like it you know what okay it. because they're like oh now i get it this is wonderful and then she got out by just making him want a cheeseburger which i totally get why that would work because uh, she reached out to him on a personal level and realized like she sh really shouldn't be here like she understood him um, well, and I think that he was trying to exact revenge on specific people for specific reasons. Yeah. And that he was almost, what I what I took away from that is he was almost looking for an excuse to let her go yeah. before everything else happened. 
and that she like reached into his psyche and gave him that excuse yeah. when she said you know it, just like letting him experience the joy of cooking for somebody again knowing the one thing that like really he truly loved like doing. she gave him a gift and as a return he, he will yep, let, he her, let her leave yeah but on the opposite spectrum if you really were expecting like a horror movie which i don't think the trailer full on when horror it was more like a thriller yeah um so if you were expecting a thriller i can see if some people will be disappointed with what they got because it was a little bit everywhere but we kind of at some point i think accepted that we, <laughs> yeah. we were just gonna let the movie take us wherever it mm -hmm. wanted us to go mm -hmm. guys you let us know what you thought of this movie i know a few of you have commented on our videos and our posts saying that you really love this movie so i totally get why but make sure to like subscribe and press the notification bell so that way you get notified when our next movie reaction is gonna come out next but until then we have been your source for horror analysis criticism and spooky okay and sometimes kooky entertainment Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.